very well done by having played so well over the two games. Yeah, I think we're the better side over the, the two games, but ultimately you 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 got to get the place in the final, and I think the goalkeeper for them has won them the the tie really. Um, Performance-wise, we were outstanding. And I thought again tonight, some of our play was very good, created chances, and there wasn't going to be many chances in the game from both sides. But certainly in the first half, we we created enough to to maybe get you know a couple of goals. But um, it's just that their keeper made some very good saves, and and ultimately, I think has has won them the tie. What do your players learn from an experience like this, playing like this? Of course, it hurts because. You put so much into it. You know, you've seen them at the end; they were dead in the feet. You know, the extra time they just with nothing else. You know, we we done everything in the game. You know, we they, we played three four three and flipped the team about, and they and as I said, in, in extra time to play with three diamond three and to try and create more pressure. But um, but the learn for them is you know for us to be successful at times it's got to hurt as well. I think in this competition in particular, we've started to get our flow back again in our football, and very importantly for us in how we press the game. And I thought we gave Chelsea a lot of problems, you know. So, um, but it wasn't to be. There's a lot of incidents to ask you about, mostly involving Diego Costa, stamp penalty, one with skirt, or you go through them in order. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's an outstanding player, an outstanding footballer. He obviously has this edge to him that. I think when you see the the TV incidents on on the two that he had with Emery Jan, that was poor. I felt you know you can easily hurdle over the young player there, and he directs his studs right onto his ankle, which could have been nasty. And then the one with Martin Skirtle again. There's no need to do it. That's the, the sad thing of it. He's a top class player, um, and he's clever enough to. Well, the, the, the officials don't see it, but it's it, it was poor really by him because he's an outstanding player, top player, and doesn't need to do it. Were you surprised that the, the officials didn't see the? I mean, the stamp one was, was very close to the touchline, wasn't it? Very close to you. Yeah, surprised yeah, that the officials but didn't see it. it's you know they clearly didn't. No, and what, and if they had, would, is it is it a red card in your, in your view? Well, that's up to the officials. I think it's it certainly would have been yeah, it was. That wasn't good for the game, you know. And but as I said, the referees didn't see it. It's not my job to to tell them, you know. But I think when you see it afterwards, it's disappointing when you see such a good player behave like that. So one of your regrets, though, that it might have changed the game very early on. It was only in the twelfth minute that first the first stamp on chance. Yeah, I don't really think about that too much because he stayed on the field. You know, I'm only I sit here just with pride. There's disappointment that we haven't got through. But Chelsea arrived. In the top of the game, when they came to Anfield last week, and, and we were outstanding and should have won that game, you know. And then tonight, we we were very, very good again. So the learning for us is to make the make the next step. You see a lot of young players out there working, and and now, we, as I said, we got to make the next step and and try and go on and win a trophy. How do you think the players can do that then? Can take that next step and go to be a successful side? Of the well, these type of experiences. Help that. And as I said, we wanted to do everything, and I think we did do everything we possibly could to get to the final. We just failed to uh, to be clinical. You know, I think that we created the chances. You seen in particular the first half and at Anfield, we, we had enough opportunities to, to score, but uh, just couldn't couldn't make the finishing touches. Brendan, it seems to get quite lively between both benches on a number of occasions. What were your views on? It's there's no problem. It's a competitive game. It's a it's a big game. Two top sides, so the chimp comes out every now and then. <laughs> <laughs>